my veins I've been driving this train Years in this lane There's no stop in this flame Cause I came to the game And I changed it to play How I like rearranged it to my own domain Yeah, I got what it takes Made lots of mistakes Taking shots, skipping breaks Feeling lost Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Um, we are here at PRI. We're over in the trailer area. Uh, wanted to take a look at a couple of new things, uh, new items, and see what we can uh, possibly get for maybe 2023, or show you guys what's also available as well. Uh, we stopped by and talked to Phil's Trailers, uh, and they are showing us their new Hallmark Stacker trailer that they are outfitting and getting everything uh, together on. They also have their regular uh, tag trailer, uh, they have a 32 foot that's over next to me. We're gonna show you some cool stuff there. It's got AC in it. It's even got some uh, closing doors in the back so you have some privacy. They make some really awesome stuff. So let's go ahead and uh, jump in these, take a look and uh, show you what's really new uh, in the world of trailers for PRI 2022. Inside, this is a 28 foot stacker trailer made by Hallmark, sold by Phil's Trailers out of Waco, Texas. The stacker that's here is a, uh, I believe 9,000 pound. We got it right here, bam. Uh, stinger stacker um, with a, the hoist is and they have a bunch of add-ons that you can do to close everything in and above us here is all storage so if you're looking for possibly storing engines or transmission anything that may be an extra where you're having the extra length for that storage well now you can actually put it up top and you have less length there why is less length important on there well one you have laws and rules out there for how long you're going to be but also from where your wheels are to the tongue is that pivot point and that's what's really important so let's go ahead um, i'm going to go walk around here with the camera show you guys what's going on and some of the other cool stuff and then we're going to jump over to their regular 32 foot tag trailer it's got some really neat things inside that so let's uh start from the rear here as you can see you have your stacker stinger right up here coming through um this is a blackout edition so they have all the black in here um, the cabinets, everything, uh, full stereo inside here. Um, all of these cabinets, this is going to be for maybe your driver's suit and gear. You have storage down here for parts, tools, um, and right here is actually your generator where they can also take your generator and put it on the front outside and then turn this into an extra cabinet. When they put it on the front outside, they actually put AC in here. We're gonna go over to the other trailer that's over there and show you that here in just a sec. All right, guys, you see me? Probably not. Well, take a look at this. New door here at the back of the trailer, so you can actually close it off. Um, it's actually set about maybe four or five foot uh, on the dovetail, so you can close this off. You could have uh, merchandise sales, you could have all kinds of things here, or just a little bit more privacy, close that up. These also take, and they will swing out. So that way you can load everything up and they actually clip into the side and they have a natural one that's going to come right back. Pretty cool setup on there uh, with the lights and everything. Let's go up inside here, take a look a little bit more. So further up front in that exact same trailer right here, they have an AC unit set up. So that way you can go ahead and shut the doors in here and cool everything down. So if you're outside, you have guys that are working in the heat, you're in Texas in the middle of the summer uh, or even down in Georgia. You can go ahead and keep everything cool and have a nice place to come relax and do your tuning. On the front of this trailer is actually where they put the generator and all the other stuff for the heat and AC. Um, so that way it gives you a little bit more room in here and a little bit more storage on the sides. Uh, we're over at the Holly booth. I've been able to talk to them about a lot of the new things they have coming out. Uh, a lot of really neat items uh, for tuning and uh, updates that are gonna be happening. But uh, at the same time, I've already put out on my own personal pages, um, but to get let everybody know, we are actually going to be starting a intro to Holly EFI class. Uh, it's going to be a class that's kind of set up for about four to six people and doing a lot of them at your garage where a lot of the guys are getting together, uh, some buddies that have some stuff and want to learn how to use their Holly a little bit better. I was able to talk to them about some other little patches and issues that are going on and uh, they're able to kind of smooth me out uh, on some other items to be able to help you guys out. We will have new classes kind of being set up in January. If it's something you're interested in, please feel free to uh, email me at greg at badinfluencegarage.com. Get your guys together and uh, we can start talking about some pricing and uh, getting out there to help you. These classes are gonna be kind of set up for someone who already has the car, uh, they've put it together, they've taken it to the dyno, uh, it's been tuned, 
and when they go to the track, they don't kind of know what's going on in there. Uh, we're trying to bridge that gap to help people learn what to do with their car when they're at the track to get them down. Holly EFI, they're here to uh, help me out, help you out, and help the industry as, in general. So back at the PRI show uh, for 2022, and we are over in the Stroud booth. Now, Stroud released here at PRI a new 20 series SFI boot. Now, this is not a booty that's gonna go over your shoes or anything like that. This is a boot that is going to encapsulate your foot, everything already in there. You have a strap on the front, everything is going to be leather on this, so that way you cannot walk out of the boot, anything there on a sticky track. Now, on the bottom, right here, it is a vibrant sole, which is also, uh, it is slip proof, so you don't have any oil on the track or anything where you're gonna have to worry about slipping. It's also fire uh, retardant. Um, everything has Kevlar stitching on this, and it is a amazing piece right here. It actually is, comes apart like this. You slip in, no zipper or anything like that. It's all going to be Velcroed on. Um, inside, you can see all Kevlar stuff inside and out. This is offered in a size four uh, in US men's up to a size 15 in US men's as well. Um, if you are running an alcohol, uh, boosted application for anything on there or you just want to be extra safe in your nitrous car or anything this is the boot that you're going to need to run uh, this is the proper thing to be having for safety uh, hey, we are walking through machinery row right now and that's the last day i'm trying to get you guys a couple more um, items out here i've been very bad at videoing this week uh every time i stop in a booth i end up talking about stuff hey mr mr Heike, how are you doing hey. So uh, we've been very bad at uh, filming because every time I stop in a booth, I end up talking business and then we end up having questions about YouTube stuff and uh, video editing and where a lot of people are trying to uh, get some more uh, content out for people. So uh, I'm going to head over here and talk to Dynacom. Last year, we showed you guys their new uh, fuel injector cleaner and flowing tool, uh, but they now have a little bit more budget friendly and smaller ones. So let's see if we can get them to uh, possibly talk about that. As we did last year, we showed you guys the new Dynacom uh, injector flowing and cleaning system. Now they have a new one that's coming out this year. Um, they have it on display, a little bit smaller, and uh, Allison's gonna kind of tell us a little bit about it. Hey, Greg. Hey, good to see you. <laughs> you too. <laughs> Yeah, last year we brought the AIC 24 that could do 24 injectors and it had a carousel. We found that that was more for like OEM level companies. For the smaller shops and for price wise, we came out with a AIC 8, stands for Automated Injector Characterization, and it does up to eight injectors. With these beakers, it's a lot of people are like, well, it seems like the old school ones where it's, you know, you're looking at the beaker, you're writing it down. You have the ability to do that, and that's here also for calibration. Really, what's counting it, we have two flow meters, and we also have two power supplies for the low impedance and the high impedance injector. So you can do something that's going to be, say, like a Bosch 210 or 220 type of video on there, but you can also flow like the new AFIS 800 or anything that's going to be a peak and hold. It's got a dual fuel pump option. Uh, it's actually from the Hellcat. Uh, oh, so wow. it's 525 liters per hour. Okay. And uh, the nice thing is it also has the ability to test fuel pumps. So you, you can take out a, one of the fuel pumps and you can put your own fuel pump in. Oh, wow. We also have the ability to interface to different ECUs. Every ECU, as you know, has its own injector driver. Absolutely, it does. And that can <laughs> cause all kinds of issues if you're flowing on one type of a driver and then you're going to be using another one, um, especially for drivability things on the street, that can definitely cause issues. Now, um, pricing and everything on this, is that uh, out right now? Is it on the website or uh, yeah. what, what do we have there? Uh, starts, you know, there's options because we have like a cleaning, uh, a cleaning option where the harness goes uh, into a bath, but it's not just a, like a standard, you know, hover freight type of cleaning bath. You actually have to energize the injector to open it, to clean it properly. It starts at $9,995. Okay. Yeah. And then depending on what else you want to add on, it can go up from there. Exactly. So if you guys are a serious fuel injection shop where you're going to be doing a lot of flowing or having a lot of big injectors and a lot coming through there, take a look at this um, and you can go ahead. I'll put the link to their website right here. And you can give them a call at any time. All right, everybody, that is going to wrap up PRI 2022 uh, for the Bad Influence Garage channel. Now, in years before you guys had seen, uh, we've gone through and talked to a bunch of different people, done daily uploads. And this year we were in a ton of different classes. We were talking to a lot of different people and tying up maybe some sponsorships or anything that would be related to our shop at Paradigm Automotive.
That being said, we have a lot of new things that are going to be coming out after the first of the year, as well as our new intro to Holly EFI classes. So we're going to go ahead, take the rest of the day off. We're going to be leaving tomorrow morning. Until next time, guys, be safe out there. Ice in my veins, I've been driving this train. Years in this lane, there's no stop in this flame. Cause I came to the game and I changed it to play. How I like rearranged it to my own domain. Yeah, I got what it takes, made lots of mistakes. Taking shots, skipping breaks, feeling lost, feeling...